Dispense with reading of the introductions. Chair objection. Hearing none, we will do that. Resolution, petitions, memorials, and other papers. We have none, Mr. Speaker. Thank you, Mr. Clerk. This time we'll have the introductions of guests and visitors. Do we have any introductions to be made? Gentlemen from Holmes, Mr. Clark. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Ladies and gentlemen of the House, I want you to help me make welcome my first cousin who's visiting from Phoenix, Arizona in the, in the South Gallery, Ms. Flosheen Sanders. Uh, also with her is my stepmom, Joanne Clark, and also in the South Gallery is my most demanding, most demanding um, constituent and my predecessor, uh, former pro tem Robert Clark. Let's help them make work. Mr. Pro Tem, we're proud to see you today. Welcome back. Glad to have you. For those of you who may not know, Mr. Clark was the first African American elected to the House of Representatives and served as Pro Tem, and uh, we're mighty proud to see him back here today. Welcome. Glad to have you. And, sir, you have, floor, you have floor privileges, so you're welcome to come down here if you would like to. Gentleman Smith, Mr. Tullis. Members of the House, I would ask that you help me welcome my daughter, Taylor Tullis, who's home from Jones Junior College. <laughs> Gentleman from Madison, Mr. Black. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Ladies and gentlemen, I want you to help make welcome our doctor of the day, Dr. Scott Hamilton. Uh, who is the director of the Mississippi Medical Association Physician Health Program. Yeah, he's from Madison. Thanks. Thank you, Doctor, for serving us today. We appreciate you being here. Gentleman from Kemper. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. I'd like for the House to make welcome in the North Gallery, the Kemper County EMA Director, Mr. Ben Dudley. Gentleman from Kapaya. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Um, in the South Gallery, I'd like for the House to help me make welcome a, a longtime friend from the most diversified county in the state of Mississippi, Kapaya, from Hazelhurst, where the grass is greener, the air is cleaner, the sky is bluer, and the sugar is sweeter, Mr. Eric Hike. Jim from home, Mr. White. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. I'd like you in the house um, to help me make welcome back here on the back row. We have my desk mate's daughter, Miss Abby Bell, and her friend Grace Gaddy. They are paging in the Senate this week, and they came down here to see how it was really done. Let's make, help them be made welcome. Jim from Alcorn. Thank, thank you, Mr. Speaker. On behalf of myself and Representative Gibson, it does me great pleasure to represent a dear and introduce a dear, dear friend of me, of myself, Alcorn County, who is now the Executive Director of the Christian Action Commission. Stand up, Dr. Kenny Digby. Do we have any other introductions? I don't see any. Announcements, Mr. Clerk. We'll have page pictures immediately after adjournment. Announcements, Madam Clerk. No announcements. Any announcements by the members? Gentleman from Jackson, Mr. Geis. Journey of memory, Mr. Speaker. Do you recognize? I'd like for the House to help me journey of memory of Ms. Helen Louise Gartman Ross from the City of Biloxi. Thank you. Okay. Thank you, sir. Other announcements? I don't see any. Recognize the gentleman from Holmes for the motion. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. I move the House stand adjourned until 9 a.m. tomorrow. You've heard the motion. All in favor say aye. Opposed, nay. Ayes have it. House is adjourned until 9 a.m. tomorrow.